Ecologically Addressing Housing. One Community Weekly Progress Update, number 359. One Community is a 501c3 nonprofit organization. We are creating open source and free shared blueprints and resources, tools and tutorials, and do-it-yourself instructions for highest good living. Creating solution models that create additional solution creating models in the service of all life on this planet. My name is Jay Sable, and I'm the executive director of the One Community 501c3 nonprofit organization, and this is our February 9th, 2020 edition of our weekly progress update. Uh, One Community's goal, if you're not already familiar with it, is to bring the other people to consciousness, to the highest good of all life on this planet, and to build sustainable and self-replicating teacher demonstration hubs as a pathway to global sustainability. And we produce a weekly progress written blog as well, progress update blog. And if you'd like to visit that, if you'd like to see all the details and specifics of what we've accomplished in the last seven days, visit that. Today, what I'm going to talk about, I always have a topic, is ecologically addressing housing ecologically addressing housing. A lot of people don't know that my background is in holistic health. And one of the things that set me on the path to creating one community was learning that the building materials that are used today are A, unsustainable, but they're also almost all toxic. Like the paints that we use are toxic. The carpet that we use is toxic. The adhesives that we use is toxic. You know, most of the building materials, the, the preservatives and stuff that are sprayed in the wood that we build with is also toxic. I mean, it's amazing what we're living in. And so ecologically addressing housing for us, it has several different foundational components to it. Uh, number one is building without a bunch of toxic goop that'll kill us uh, or make us sick or at least put a stress, an ongoing stress on our immune systems. Uh, but number two is making do-it-yourself housing models. And our idea is that if we can build a template, a foundation of the sustainable different housing models that you see happening in the background of this video right here, and we have seven different sustainable village models that we've designed and that we're working to build, and we'll build them all in one place that people can come, visit them, experience it, see what ecological housing looks like, and decide if that's something that they might want to create as well, and stimulate the entire ecological eco-housing market by creating open source tools, tutorials, and resources, do-it-yourself instructions for these plans with the idea that, that if there's a foundation of these different plans that are out there, so people could start with that, then people will take the money that they save and having those in, from those foundational plans and they'll apply it most likely predictably to making them even better. It's like, oh, well, I'd like to add this onto there. I'd like to modify that. And so anybody that's involved with this industry, we see this as a huge opportunity for those people to work on those aspects of sustainable housing. And by open sourcing and free sharing it all, we plan and are working to stimulate the entire industry by not only producing a physical place where people can come and visit and stay in these houses and demystifying the complete process, but also by providing that template so that people have a starting place and they know exactly how much it'll cost. And it's a DIY project, so if they want to build it themselves, they don't have to make modifications. They'll be able to have permitted plans that they can take to their own engineer and then get a stamp on it in their own state, take it to their own county and say, hey, look, these are already being built in all these other counties. It's safe. Check it out. You know, And to be able to expand this model and make ecological building more mainstream. But also, because we're providing those foundations, we're teaching people how to build those foundations to stimulate the whole industry by providing more and more awesome examples of how to build and live this way. And our ecologically addressing housing for us isn't just about the house. That'd be crazy. It's also about the energy infrastructure. It's also about food infrastructure. And it's also about the emotional foundations of sustainability that we've identified and call highest good approaches to fulfilled living, highest good approaches to economics, highest good approaches to education, and true earth stewardship, highest good society. Putting all these things together so people can take the different components that they want, put them together in the ways that they want, and include that in their housing model, which in its ultimate expression, for people that are interested is creating complete teacher demonstration hubs where people can bring their friends and family, people with shared values, the people that they want to live with together and create complete eco villages and take the social architecture aspect of it and incorporate that into that to take all the different things that most people travel on vacation for and all the different toys and the things that people like to enrich their lives and make their lives more fun. The things that most people are working themselves to death for and make those things more easily accessible through cooperation, collaboration, and pooling resources to be able to provide those. 
Like if you think of your 50 best friends and all the different toys that they have, if you all lived close enough together to be able to share the different toys that you had and you had an agreement that, hey, if we share it and it breaks, that's okay because we're pooling our resources and this environment through an ecotourism uh, and model produces enough revenue so that if we break something, we just replace it. And we don't replace it with some cheap version. We're not going to go to Walmart and buy some discount version of something. We're going to buy a quality version of what it is to replace this. We're going to make sure that we have good toys. We have good tools. We have high quality tools. We have an environment that really meets our needs and exceeds our needs. This is our idea of ecologically addressing housing. To create a way of living that's founded on ecological housing that's better than the way that most people are living right now and to demonstrate it's easy enough, affordable enough, and attractive enough so the idea will spread on its own and inviting people to participate in ecologically addressing housing by open sourcing and free sharing their own adaptations and modifications to this to make it even better, to create even more options for people to participate. Does that make sense? So, and if we do this, we can create a world that works for everybody. If we can make it self-replicating, teacher demonstration hubs that teach others how to create teacher demonstration hubs as well, and we make that self-replicating, we can build these across the world in a global cooperation collaboration, teaching others how to create solution models. Solution models designed to create additional solution creating models. Self-replication. And we can create a world that works for everybody within our lifetime. Addressing the very foundations of the greatest challenges that our, our society is dealing with right now. And I could break down every single one of those I have in other videos. And so this is it. This is what we see as the solution to the challenges, the greatest challenges, not just housing, but so much more than that. And so this is what we're up to. We've been at it now for over 10 years. We've had over 400 volunteers. We're a 100% volunteer organization. We're a nonprofit organization. We're a non-governmental organization. I'm a volunteer. Every member of our team is a volunteer. And we're creating this because we want to live this way and because we see a world that works for everybody within our lifetime. And we're enjoying the process of being on the forefront of that movement, of that revolution of a highest good way of living for everybody. And we wanna see other people be able to live this way as well. Because if enough people choose this, we can change this world for the better for everybody and for every living thing on this planet within our lifetime. And that's what we're up to, that's what we're focused on. So that's what we're up to. Thanks for watching. Check out the next couple minutes of this video to see more details on each component, the food, the housing, etc. Visit our website for complete details. And until next week, we will, of course, Keep on keeping on. Thanks for following our progress. The one community approach to highest good housing is eco-artistic home building that is affordable, sustainable, do-it-yourself duplicable, resource and space efficient, and consists of seven different sustainably constructed village models. One Community is also creating an open source duplicable city center. It is designed to be LEED Platinum certified, provide 12 guest rooms, dining for over 150 people, and laundry and recreation space for over 300 people, all while saving money, time, space, and resources. One Community's approach to highest good food is duplicable almost anywhere, scalable for different needs, more biodiverse and nutritious, Part of forwarding a global open source botanical garden collaborative and includes nine different free shared and duplicable growing environments. The next component is highest good education. This component is complete and pretty much ready to launch once we're on the property. One community's approach to highest good education is designed for all age groups, adaptable to any schooling environment, inspiring and fun for all participants, includes national standards, all subjects, lesson plans, teaching strategies, learning strategies and tools, classroom design, and more. The one community approach to highest good society is globally focused, individually enriching, cooperative and collaborative, includes a highest good network and application, four different economic models, and combines fulfilled living and true earth stewardship for the benefit of all people and all life on this planet.